the single responsibility principle or SRP is that a class should only have one reason to change, meaning it should only do one thing. So if a class were to handle multiple responsibilities, it becomes harder to maintain and harder to modify. So by separating concerns into different classes or functions, we make our code cleaner, easier to test, and much more scalable. So you can see I have some problematic code right here. Now you can see that this code is doing multiple things, and it's not really clear what it's actually supposed to be doing. So here it says that this is an authentication service. So we would assume that what this is responsible for is simply authentication. So something like logging in, well, that makes sense. But logging an event doesn't really make sense to be doing inside of the authentication service. We may want to log something, but we shouldn't have the implementation of our logger directly inside of this class. So how can we fix this? Well, we can write some code like this. So notice that yes, the code is a little bit longer now, but what we've done is we've added two classes, an auth service, which we had previously, and the logger class, which now takes over the implementation of logging events. So if we zoom in here, you can see that the logger simply takes this method, it defines the log file, and then in our authentication service, we actually take an instance of this logger and then we can use it within the login method. So this way we've kept things separate, each class has a single responsibility. And if I want to change what the logger is doing, it's very clear where to do that. I change it inside of the logger. 